It's suey. Can you do that? <laughs> suey. <laughs> or hey pig. Hey pig. There you go. Well guys, it's garden time. So, we brought the pigs back down to till this up a little more after it got weeds in it. Um, it's getting too hot for them to be right here. So, since they're dumping their water out to bathe in it. You're supposed to drink that water, not dump it out. Yeah. You're supposed to drink it. So we are gonna move them up on the hillside where it's very shaded. Be a lot better for them. Now it's getting warm. Zach's getting food because, well, these piggies lack the foods, huh? Yeah, you like your food? Yeah. We're also shrinking them down to just the pig fence because our charger is not powerful enough to do both fences at one time. So if you're shopping around for one of these electric fences and you have pigs, go with the larger charger. We have the 60, I think they make a 120. Do that. I'm gonna take the fence. I'm gonna go around their water over there and then back up here. And then, I wanna be able to get to the water too, so. Yeah. It's gonna be a little funky right here, and then we'll give them as much space over here as is left. I mean, we don't have to come down the hill. We could just leave it, on, just go really long. Yeah. Well, I want, I want them to get at least as much of this as they can. Yeah. There's lots of good stuff there for them. Yeah. <laughs> they know there's food. our rolls have you open it Finley wants to dump the food I would just say anywhere over there and then I'll start reeling that up because I got bigger hands so it's easier to carry the poles if you put the starter pole here and then we'll run it over well you won't be able to do a whole lot other than that because yeah. of, until I'm up here yeah and then we can wrap around and go down there yeah do that okay so I'll start reeling it in because they're focused on that bucket. Okay, Finley, when you dump it, you're going to want to dump it over here, okay? Yeah. Right here. Come over here. Because this is where we want the pigs to come. Yeah, I know. And this is where we want them to dig. Can you, are you okay. strong enough? Come up here. Yeah, it's heavy. Here, I'll bring it up. I can bring it the rest of the way. And then when mommy says to dump it, I want you to make a lot of noise so the pigs see you and then dump it right here, okay? Right. It's suey. Can you do that? Suey. <laughs> suey. Or hey pig. Hey pig. There you go. But say it really loud. Okay. And shake the bucket so it makes noise. Take the bucket, bud. Call
now they're going further. Here, still be able to put the hose on that. Tell me if, uh, if you found any morels or truffles. No? Okay. Now, I don't know if we've shown you our pig waterer. Um, we made it so that it could collect rainwater. And then we also put the nipples on it. And it's really great to fill up the hose if you need it. All right. All right. Now I just got to hook up the power supply. The only downside to this location is the sun. It's not going to get quite as much. No, but it hasn't even been working, so. I know. They're pretty good with, as long as they have food, they don't run away. <laughs> All right, who wants to touch it? It's working. I can hear it shorting out over here somewhere. Probably against the stick. Yep. So she's live. Never even thought about just being able to touch right here. Yeah. Mm. Yep, she's live. <laughs> okay. So a nice thing is these support poles are completely insulated too. So you don't have to worry about shocking yourself while using them. Uh, All right, guys. That's have plenty of food for a, at least a week. Next uh, job is to take our freshly renovated tiller and do this. There's a lot of clumps of dirt. There's a lot of everything. And this hill is going to be fun. So uh, we'll probably, uh, truthfully, I'll probably just throw some corn in there and pray for the best. Yeah, that's going to be a fun task. Probably save that for Mother's Day. Because, you know, what mother doesn't want to till up ground on Mother's Day? But this is going to be where my three sisters are. And if you see, like, poles up here already, that's where I planted some squash. 
and I'm just gonna leave the clover, the weeds in here because clover fixes nitrogen. It's gonna provide a ground cover. And as long as I know where my plants are, you know, I will just weed whack around them. I love evenings here. Wish our property was bigger, but I do, I do love, we definitely love Kentucky. Thank you guys for watching. We appreciate you. And uh, check us out on our next video. If you like this, like and subscribe. And if there's anything you wanna see, topics you want us to discuss, drop them in the comments below. We always need ideas. Have a great evening and happy Mother's Day to all your mamas out there.